Or it isn't, it's Thailand. So we're going to go and build a bridge over the River Kwai? Like what? Alec Guinness? <laughs> I don't know how to build a bridge. In high spirits, the journey began. We are off. Oh, yeah. We worked out that the most sensible way of getting to the river was to head right across Burma to its northernmost border crossing with Thailand. On this epic 1,200-mile journey, we would find strange new cities with no one in them, cross mountain ranges straight out of Jurassic Park, ford disease-filled rivers, and attend a party which made the scene at the end of Apocalypse Now look like a quiet night in. And we'd have to do it all in lorries which, right at the start, weren't really working properly. For our gauges, nothing works. Nothing at all. Not wonderful. Not fuel gauge, oil, oil pressure, charge, vacuum, temperature. Nothing works. Oh, the ah, that's not it. There's no synchromash on this gearbox, so when you go from third to second or whatever, you have to pull oh, bloody door, a double D clutch like that. Only smoother. Oh, I can't get out, I can't get out. Oh. oh, God. How fast am I going? And the speedo doesn't work. Oh, my giddy arm, the ride is shocking. Oh! Possibly a bit of play in the steering. Let me talk you through my brakes. Um, they don't really work. I've got three centimetres of pedal travel where nothing happens, and then a millimetre where all happens and the wheels lock up. There's no handbrake, and I'm not being stupid. I've looked everywhere. There isn't a one, there isn't a hand one, there isn't a switch. And on top of the mechanical problems, we had to deal with Rangoon's pedestrians. Stop wandering about in the road! Whoa, a granddad's just walked by the child right underneath your lorry. Whoa, somebody else just did it. Pedestrians have no concept of traffic. None at all. And there was another issue. One of the reasons that driving here is so difficult 